In this video, I'm going to show you how to get more rewards in Google Opinion Rewards. So first, let me tell you this. There's no proven way that works for everyone, which guarantees you getting rewards. So I've been using this app for the past three to four years. And over the years, I've kind of found the trend and the reasons as to which they'll give you a survey and what you can do to get more surveys. And recently, if I just show you my history, so here I've come to the app. And if I go to my reward history, and here you can see over the past two to three months, I've been getting quite a few surveys, especially in the last month of May. So in this video, I'll tell you certain things which will definitely boost your chances of getting rewards and some other things which you can do just in the hope of getting more rewards. So let's get started. So the first thing is have the app installed on your phone and then go through the survey eligibility check. So if you click on the three lines which are on the top left, here as you can see, they have an option called survey eligibility and just click on this. So here as you can see, I have green ticks everywhere, but let's say you have one which isn't ticked. Then just click on the arrow and then click on manage and just ensure that you change the setting or do whatever is required to ensure that you have green ticks in all of these categories. So this is the first thing which you have to do. Once you've done this, the second thing you have to do is give Google access to your location history. So to do this, again click on the three lines, then click on settings that's over here. And as you can see, the first option is Google location history. So it's really important to keep this on because most of the surveys which you will be asked will be about places where you've been. So they'll ask you why you went here, whether it was good, bad, all of those kind of things. So here I'll just click on the setting. I'll go to my account. And as you can see, over here, it's on. So if yours isn't, then just enable this. The third thing you should do is update the app whenever it's available. So from the Play Store or App Store, keep checking for updates and update it whenever you see it. So this is important from Google's end because they'll have a list of all the devices whose apps are up to date. So if they have to give a survey, they'll most likely give it to you rather than someone who has an old version of the app. Now the fourth trick is one which is really important. And this is when you get your first survey. So this is to not lie and make sure that everything you answer is accurate. And this is the most important. Because let's understand why Google is doing this. So they're giving out surveys to collect authentic data, which they can use. And in reward, they'll give you some Google reward points. So one thing you need to note, that Google already has a lot of information about you, and they can easily verify if your answers are correct or not. So if they ask you, if you search for one of these on Google, or if you went to one of these places, and if you're in a hurry and you randomly click something, and they see that you haven't been there, then that's a big red flag for them because then they'll know that they aren't receiving authentic data. So I can't stress enough on this point that if you do get a survey, just take your time, ensure that you're answering correctly. Because if you answer one thing wrong, then Google will know that it's false and they'll stop sending you surveys from then on. Now, there are two more things which you can do. First, just ensure that notifications are enabled for Google Opinion Rewards. So many times it's possible that you've been given a survey, but you just won't see it because it doesn't come in notifications and that's the only way to access them. So once, just go to settings on your phone, search for Google Opinion Rewards, and ensure that notifications are enabled with sound with the banners on top, so that when you get a survey, you can answer it. And the last step is for someone who just isn't receiving any surveys despite following all of these methods. So let's say you last received a survey six months back, and since then, you haven't gotten any more. Then this method is for you. I'll suggest just deleting your account and then creating one again. So to do this, just go to the app, click on the three lines, which are on the top left, click on settings, and here click on delete opinion rewards account. So this is like the last resort. If nothing else is working, then you should do this and just get a fresh start. But for everyone else, if you follow these methods, give it about two to three weeks, and I'm sure that there's a very high chance after that, you'll start getting surveys. So these are basically all of the methods which I feel will work and let me know down in the comments whether they work for you or not. So that's it for today and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.